far more convincing victory for the rebels this time around, following up from last week's frustration against Veupunama. PNG and Rebels captain Lua Rikis all class as a prowess inside the D boosted her side's winning streak. <laughs> Leading by 15 points to 6 in the first quarter, that lead was extended to a massive 43 to 24 as the game ended the third quarter. The final quarter would see a host of changes for the Rebels, introducing their youth side as they prepared for what will most likely be a playoff position in the upcoming finals. <laughs> Goal defender Winnie Mavara happy with the side's performance as the Rebels cruised to a comfortable 57-37 to goal win. We won, but like you could disappointed with the win. I thought uh, we took them too lightly or they, were, they came out what, wanting to play and we didn't want to play something like that. But today we wanted to improve on last week's performance. We did really well. Um, I think it was team support, team encouragement out there that pushed us to slot in more goals. In the other Tier 2 match, it was a more even contest between Veupunama and Raukele. <laughs> Raukele is Melissa Elaupa and Verera Kala fighting to keep the scores tight. As the first quarter ended 11 all, the second with Raukela a single point ahead, and the third, that side, four points behind. <laughs> Their resilience, however, holding through as they fought back in the final quarter to take back the win of 41 38. Yeah, uh, I think we needed to uh, keep to the basics and keep it simple instead of doing um, overworking ourselves and um, passing from right from the middle, uh, bring it up to the circle and uh, keep it simple, short and simple, yeah. Yes, we did. Uh, we had a lot of turnovers, but our guests didn't really have to go for the attack. We kept on falling back, so yeah. The competition is scheduled for this weekend at the Rita Flynn Complex. Jeremy Moggy, National TV Sports.